the 60 second driver. Leaving enough room between you and the vehicle ahead can help you avoid a dangerous collision. A safe following distance ensures you'll have the time to react if the person in front of you slams on their brakes or swerves unexpectedly. In the city, allow four second following distance, six seconds on the highway. In poor road conditions, allow more time. Here's an easy way to determine your following distance. Pick a landmark on the side of the road. Any stationary object will do, whether it's a traffic sign, crosswalk, or building. I'll use the speed limit sign as a landmark. As the vehicle ahead of you passes a landmark, start counting 1 1,000, 2 1,000, 3 1,000, 4 1,000. Maintaining a safe following distance is one of the easiest ways that you can prevent a collision. For more driving tips, watch the 60 Second Driver, Thursdays at 6 on CTV News. Brought to you by Manitoba Public Insurance.